Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can enable USB tethering or you can uh, use the Bluetooth tethering to, uh, to share the internet connections on your phone to your Windows uh, laptop. So the first thing you want to do is to connect the USB cables if you decide to use USB tethering. So use the USB cable, connect to the phone, and then connect it to the laptop. Once it is connected to the laptop, go back to the home screen by tapping on the home key then swipe down and tap on the settings icon in here tap on connections and then go down and tap on mobile hotspot and tethering and then enable USB tethering so tap on enable So I'm just going to tap on the enable button right there. Once you do that, it may ask you if you want to allow connections on your phone, just tap on yes. Now on a PC, you should be able to um, see the connections. So right here, you can see. So that's right there, it shows the internet access connections so if I'm going to turn it off on the phone now you can see that one will goes away and if I enable it on my phone you can see here it will start to connect and you can also tell us from this one over here inside uh, it works so I'll just go back here open network and sharing center then go to change adapter settings and here you can see it shows Samsung mobile USB remote connection or something like that remote NDIS network device and basically that allows the phone to uh, share the internet connections on the phone let's, let's say you got um, 30 gigs of data like I've got 30 gigs of data on the phone so I can share it to my laptops and I can use it now one of the problem that might you may have is uh, the drivers so you may not have the drivers installed on your computer already so when you try to uh, first connect it will attempt to download and install the drivers so make sure your laptop is connected to the internet uh, for the drivers to be downloaded and installed for the first time and once it is installed your computer the next time you don't need to uh, do all that again and you should be able to uh, simply just turn it on and off to use the internet connections so here you can see um, I'm just going to load up a web page and I'll type in something test you can see it load up the page uh, no problems so speed test And then I can click on go. So it's downloading. Uh, it's testing my 4G. So on my phone, I'm using 4G at the moment. So, so that's my 4G right there. So it's just testing, testing the download speed. So that's around eight uh, megabit per, sin, per, uh, per second. Uh, downloading using 4G on my phone. And that's it, that's how you can enable USB tethering. Again, it's uh, similar to um, Bluetooth. Uh, if your computer has Bluetooth and it is compatible with Bluetooth on the Samsung Galaxy S8, then you can uh, simply turn it on. Uh, you need to um, share it down here. At the moment, my device, uh, the Bluetooth on the computer, on the laptop, is not compatible with this phone, so it requires some driver's download. So. So I'm not going to uh, go ahead and use the Bluetooth method, so you can just use the cable instead, it's much easier. But you can actually also use the Bluetooth uh, tethering if you wanted to, uh, provided that you install the appropriate drivers on your laptop. And that's it, thank you for watching this video, please subscribe to my channel for more videos.